Hello my friends, welcome back to my channel Diamonds and Washi. My name is Katie and if you are new here, hey, welcome. I hope you'll consider subscribing for lots more diamond painting content. And if you are back, welcome back. Today I am here with an unboxing of Diamond Art Club's 2023 advent calendar. Um, and this just came in and so you might hear my little ones in the background because I was like, oh, I'm gonna quick try to film this for you guys. Um, but they did an advent calendar for the first time last year in 2022 and it was so popular and sold out incredibly quickly. And unfortunately this one sold out as well even though they ramped up from what they said production a ton. Uh, it lasted a couple hours this time but it has unfortunately sold out but maybe you could pick it up in D-Stash groups or if there's different things that people are going to want to sell from, you know, different elements of this that they don't necessarily want to keep. Um, you could take, you could take a look at some uh, D-Stash groups like on Facebook to see if you can pick up anything that catches your eye here. But we're going to get into all of this today. And so I will tell you right up front, there will be spoilers. All the spoilers are going to be in this unboxing. So if you don't want to see it, definitely do not watch this video. <laughs> I would feel really, really bad if I spoiled it for anyone. I'm going to try to make it really clear that we are going to look at every single day in this calendar and everything that has been included. So please, please, please click away if you got this and you want to save for the surprise. But I know some people really just start like, give me all the spoilers. I need it. <laughs> so um, let me go ahead and open up this box, which is sealed. This looks really close to the size of the box from last year. Maybe a little bit bigger. I'm not sure. Um, but this, I don't know if last year Diamond Art Club told us like what the different kinds of things were that we're going to be in it. But this year in like the social media preview and on the listing page, they told us specifically like, okay, there are going to be X many diamond paintings and there's going to be this thing and there's going to be this thing. They didn't show pictures, but they did tell us like, okay, this is going to be in there. Like, okay, um, you guys, <laughs> seriously, spoilers, uh, starting now, really, uh, here it's going to tell us this is, these are the contents. Um, this is what they told us in the listing as well. So uh, last, I guess last chance to click away for this part, but here's what the contents are going to be in here. So, um, got their socials down here. This packaging is super cute. I love that it looks like a house. Um, and it's, it's so fun. So fun. So we're going to unwrap it like a gift. <laughs> Let's take a look and see what's in here. So ooh, let me zoom you out so you can see a little bit more of this. All right, there we go. I figured you might want to actually see all of it. So, so cute. Each of the doors are numbered. And I'm curious if you're, I feel like doing these kind of holiday calendar. I don't know if this is technically an advent calendar because of the number of days, if you want to get really technical, but uh, are you someone that's like, if you get something like this, you want to rip into all of it immediately? Or are you the one that's like, okay, one a day, one a day. <laughs> um, I will admit that I did not look closely at the listing to see what was going to be included in this because I wanted to have a little bit of surprise <laughs> when it comes to it. So um, we're going to go ahead and start looking at everything that's been included though. So we're going to go through it in order, starting with day number one and going through day number 12. Like I said, all the spoilers are happening here. So please, please, please do me a favor and click away if you don't want to have spoilers. Um, I'm going to see, I'm using, yeah, I'm using the flat end of tweezers and parks I'm wearing nails and in parks I'm trying, yeah, not to destroy it. So first up you guys, let me see if I can get these out. Let me pop them out with the tweezers. There we go. I'm telling you what, tweezers have all kinds of, <laughs> of uses. So, all right, here we go. Spoilers, spoilers, spoilers. Day number one, we get, is this, is that a fairy dust color? We get two jars of diamonds. So uh, 25 ounces or seven grams each. This one is one of their electro diamonds. It's like, like a gold metallic looking diamond. I love this one. There are totally different ways you could easily enhance your painting with this. Um, if you're hearing that sound, it's a game my kid, my oldest is playing. You're not, you don't have a police car in your backyard. <laughs> uh, anyway, this one I think is one a jar of their fairy dust diamonds, which has a really pretty glitter coating on it on the top. And then this one's, they're both rounds actually. So some fun enhancement diamonds. I feel like this is actually something that we commonly see people ask for from Diamond Art Club is like, hey, could you, would you ever sell like your special diamonds um, sort of a la carte? And I would love if that's like a precursor to, yes, them selling, selling their special diamonds <laughs> uh, for us to be able to buy just kind of individually. Because I mean, especially those fairy dust diamonds, I'm obsessed. They're my favorite special drill. <laughs> so that was door number one. And then door number two. Oh, cute. Okay, we had some of these last year. Um, it's a pack of some holiday minders. 
And these ones are a little different, it looks like, just in the way that they're made. Maybe a little different from the ones that come in your toolkit. Um, they look, feel like they're made of a slightly different material, but they're all holiday themed. And they all have the magnets on the back um, so that you can use it to hold back the plastic cover of your diamond painting while you're working. So that's cute that they all have a holiday theme. So anyway, we get that four pack of minders. That is our day two. Day three, ooh, this one's big. Okay, let me see if I can reach it. Yeah, this is way easier on, on the fingers. Than... Ooh, cute. Okay, so this says it's a set of diamond painting coasters. So these have gotten really popular like from other brands and stuff. Um, I feel like in the diamond painting world lately and so I think Diamond Art Club's going, hey, people like coasters? Let's put one of those sets in our advent calendars. So I don't know if they'll start selling coasters at all kind of on the side on their website. I know they sell things like holiday cards, but anyway, it tells you this is gonna have six coasters in it. Um, it's got some pre-sorted diamonds. Um, there's no pictures or anything on the front. It's just an open window. Uh, so let's take a look. Okay, so they're one-sided, which I mean they're coasters, so that makes sense. Uh, and they each come with, oh, this looks like it's a piece of cork and this is probably a sticky side. So once you've diamond painted it first, then you can peel this off and stick it on here so that you've actually got a coaster ready to go. Um, but there's one of the patterns. Oh, this is cute. Um, this is one of those little unicorn heads. They did a, in the advent calendar last year, there was a kit that um, was one of these kind of like unicorn ones that same artist style cute little snowman and there's a bunch of coaster uh, bottoms here and then we have a little stocking cute little reindeer and then some jingle bells and then we're back around to the christmas tree so those are our actual uh the patterns and then the diamonds all come in here Ooh. And you guys, these look like these are mostly special drills. So uh, like these are crystals, or I think your Diamond Art Club calls their crystal drills iridescents. And then like a lot of these special drill type kits, they just put the letter on the bag. There's no legend or anything like that that comes with us. There's a letter on the bag or number, and then you match it with the letter or number that's on the coaster. And that's how you know what these go with. Uh, so I see some crystal, oh, I see some oversized ones in there too. Let's look really quick. So we do have some crystals in here. Just for sake of time, I'm not gonna like go through every single one, but I was just gonna point out, okay, we do have uh, some like oversized ones. These are larger than the other crystal sizes are, like if you look at them side by side. So those look like they go around the borders of some of the coasters. Those are really cute. We have some ABs, and then the rest of these look like they're crystals. So that's really fun. That's a good, I feel like that's a nice little like sort of gateway to diamond painting for a lot of people is like the coaster sets or other special drill sets, like little sets. So that's a really fun inclusion. I like that. And especially when you've got like an advent calendar like this, where it's like, well, practically speaking, it's just gonna be a particular size. You know, that makes sense to me too. So anyway, that was day number three. Let's keep going, day number four. I also cannot believe, knock on wood, that my youngest has been like really quiet upstairs. <laughs> so I've been able to film this. Normally I film in the evenings when they're not, when they're asleep. So, okay, second set, ooh, diamond painting stickers. Now we've seen Diamond Art Club do diamond painting stickers before. This is another like kid and beginner friendly diamond art, uh, diamond art option. Um, these look really cute. I like that you can see the stickers through the window of this box. Tells you what's included, six stickers and the diamonds that go with them. So, oh my gosh, I totally want to work on these with my kids this year. These are adorable. Look at the little Christmas tree with the eyes. Okay, those are adorable. And it's same deal as with the coasters, you guys. We have these, these diamonds that have the letters on the packaging that you just match up with here. And these are like the other kind of beginner kid-friendly stickers that you can get in the stores in that they are all these kind of larger size. So they're much friendlier for little hands to be able to pick up. There's no toolkit included with these. Um, um, but I wonder if there will technically be enough tools included in the advent calendar to make up for that. I don't know. That's just an observation, though. Um, so if you were going to give that to someone, you know, we'd need to know that, like, oh, there aren't any there aren't any tools for them. So anyway, that was door number four. Let's get into door number five. 
Oh, I ripped it. It was going so well. Okay. Ornaments this time. So diamond painting ornaments in door number five. So same kind of uh, similar situation as the stickers it look, and the coasters. Just always like little snacky special drill type things. Um, again, this one's gonna have oh three ornaments and holiday ribbon and then your diamonds. Everything is wrapped in here. So here are your ornaments. Ooh, and these are double-sided. There's a little plastic film on either side you'll wanna peel up to be able to put your diamonds down. So a little snowman, a little mitten, and a little stocking. All your diamonds are in here. It looks like lots of special like crystal drills again. Ooh, I see some special shaped ones in here too. You see those like kind of little almond slivers? That's fun and I see some like large size ones in here too. And then they include these cute little, these little ribbons so that you can uh, hang them if you want to. And they're brand, they're Diamond Art Club branded. That's so cute. I'm sure if you didn't necessarily want something that was Diamond Art Club branded, you could just, you know, use a piece of holiday ribbon or something like that. So yay for some cute holiday ornament goodness. So you're all set. You've got coasters to set out. You've got ornaments to hang. You've got stickers to do with your kids. Lots and lots of cute stuff here. So anyway, you guys. All right. So that was door number five. Now door number six, I have got to put money on that this one's going to have a kit in it. Uh, last year's advent, the 2022 advent had uh, two diamond painting kits in it. They were real cute little snack size ones. And I'm guessing that that's what we're going to be working with here as well. So let's look. Oh, cute. Okay. That's adorable. <laughs> So we do have a kit here. It's called Meowy Christmas. It's by Eau Claire Studios. And it's just cute little kitten. And this one's gonna be 23 by 35 centimeters or about nine by 13.8 inches. It's gonna have round diamonds. Uh, we'll open this up and take a really quick look at the canvas just so you guys can see or if there are any other fun like special drills we wanna take a look at. I actually have to, I confess, this one was spoiled for me <laughs> um, unintentionally, and it is it is what it is. It's totally fine, but I actually have no idea what kit is in door number 12, so I'm actually glad this was number six because that means that whatever is in door number 12 is an actual surprise for me, so that's fun. Now, a lot of times with these smaller snack size kits that are really little, you're going to get more of like this basic tool kit. Um, this was one of Diamond Art Club's like older tool kits. They upgraded their tool kits like a year and a half ago or two years ago, and so you'll still sometimes see these ones in these tiny snack size kits I think because the upgraded toolkits literally cannot fit in here so um, this is still gonna come with yeah you're still gonna get everything that normally comes with it like this blog book sticker and let's take a really quick look at uh, the canvas and everything okay so it's really little totally snack size beginner friendly uh, 43 colors though that's colorful for a little one this size um, it's got all the same features that you've come to know and love from diamond art club like the really soft backed canvas uh, the nice drill field uh, that's got sticky poured glue it's legally licensed um, it's got the lifetime warranty it's got all those things that you've come to know and love from diamond art club including we have a pamphlet. Actually, this is one of their old school pamphlets too, <laughs> like from one of their older kits. So that's really fun. <laughs> it's like a, a blast from the past here. Uh, we have a sticker sheet with these are all the sticker labels, a spot to write your start and end date. And this is going to have some special drills, including two ABs and one fairy dust color. Um, I see the fairy dust right here. That's again, that's the diamond that has like the glitter coating brushed on top. Um, and then we have some ABs in here as well. I see like a beige AB. Just for sake of time, I'm not going to pull this all out to look at it um, because like I said I want to get through this whole advent calendar with you guys but this is the adorable one of the adorable diamond paintings that's going to be included with your advent calendar and uh, th yeah that's that's a really good like works up quickly beginner friendly all the things so that's fun that diamond art club is including those so anyway that was door number six we are halfway through let us keep going door number seven this one's i think one of the bigger doors on the kit so let's take a look Ooh, a 3d christmas tree okay i think i i remembered seeing maybe this in like the listing or the preview name and i wasn't totally sure what that was gonna look like so uh it says Double-sided acrylic tree plate, two pieces, and there's a wooden base, and there's pre-sorted uh, diamonds as always. So 
we'll take a look here. All right, so, oh, sure enough, that's actually a nice kind of sturdy base there. Okay, so, sorry, my youngest one made an appearance. So we do have these two separate plates that are each double-sided. Same as the ornaments have that thin plastic film you wanna peel back to be able to put the diamonds on. So you wanna diamond paint these first, and once they're diamond painted, these will slide together. I don't wanna do this and mess up like the plastic film by accident, because I feel it kind of wanting to shift. Um, but then it'll, it'll, it'll stick together like that. And then you'll be able to pop these like into the base. You can see how that's gonna fit right there. So super, super cute idea a little 3d fun um there are some ab's and uh some crystals of varying sizes in here so that's a fun little like craft again something that would be cute to do with your kids or someone that's newer to diamond painting or family so anyway door number eight let's take a look this one's a little one do you think it's going to be a small accessory? Oh, yep, it is. So say a little small accessory like washi tape or like a, a metal multi-placer would have been my other guess. So it's like really stuck in there. Ah. <laughs> I'm not doing this the smart way, I think. Okay, come on. It's like really wedged in there. Okay, got it. <laughs> so we have the wash, uh, a few rolls of holiday washi tape in here, which is so fun. Uh, we've got, let's take a look. I'm a sucker for washi tape. If you wanna see some videos on like what I use washi tape for with diamond painting, I'll do my best to remember to link to that below. But they're, they're, there's not a ton on these rolls. They're not really thick, but they are really cute. They're super, super cute. I can't seem to get them all right side up. I'm riding the struggle bus today. Okay, so really, really cute set of holiday washi tape in that particular door. Fun. Okay, so that was door number, was that door number eight? Yeah, okay. So that was door number eight. And then door number nine over here, it looks like another kind of larger door. Do we have any other like special drill, <laughs> drill projects that they had advertised? Oh no, oh, interesting, okay. All right, so we have a, this is new. This is a diamond painting tray. Now, let me go ahead and open this up actually. Um, this is a much larger tray than we see in their diamond painting kits. Just include one tray. Um, and that's something that I always recommend is like a really good beginner upgrade is a better tray. So uh, this is a really fun addition and it's fun that it's in red. Is there like a little bit of glitter flex in there? I wanted to see, yeah, okay. So this actually, that pops open. Uh, so I can keep the diamonds in there or you can open it up if you want to pour the diamonds out. So that's a fun addition and uh, different. Something I haven't really seen Diamond Art Club do before. So there you go. <laughs> Door number 10. Okay, my guess for this one, I think I'm going to guess a pen. I think I'm going to guess a pen for this one. And I was right. <laughs> now, last year's uh, advent calendar had a couple of pens in it. And you know what? They were kind of prone to breaking. So I'm hoping that this year's pens, uh, that they like kind of fix that quality issue. I'm really hoping. Uh, so you can get diamond painting pens from the Diamond Art Club website. This one includes, okay, so the single tip and then a couple of the plastic multi-placers. Ooh, okay, so this one is definitely giving holiday. <laughs> uh, all that red, white, and green. That's really pretty. It's like kind of a thinner pen. I also tend to recommend, okay, the multi-placers, they're kind of, they're there in the bottom. I'm not gonna try to get them out. But I do recommend a pen as one of your first upgrades as a new diamond painter. A pen and a tray. Upgrading those from the basic toolkits, I think are some of the best things that you can do that'll make your diamond painting experience go that much more comfortably and smoothly. So anyway, that was door number 10. We only have two left to go here. Door number 11. Let's see. Okay, so, oh, cute. Christmas-themed release paper. All right, I have to confess, I have not actually tried out Diamond Art Club's release paper yet, so this will be a good excuse uh, to do so. Release paper is something you can use on your diamond paintings if you want to get rid of the plastic cover. Oh, it tells you here how to use. I just put that little label sticker there. Um, uh, you can take off the plastic cover, put the white side of the release paper onto the canvas on the glue, and then you can cover up your painting, or, or you can even just you know cover up part of your painting at a time. So this is gonna have 100 pieces. They're four by four inches or 10 by 10 centimeters, which actually I like that kind of uh, section, a 10 by 10 centimeter section, especially for a confetti heavy painting. Uh, so the paper, yeah, it has, 
Let's see how thin or thick it is. Okay, so this is really thin release paper compared to, you know, if you've tried other release paper before, this is really thin. This side, you do not want to put down on the glue. It'll probably stick and cause problems. This is the side, the white is what goes down on the glue and it peels right back off. Uh, but this is so cute. Holiday themed release paper is an adorable idea and is a really fun um, inclusion in this advent calendar. So I love that. <laughs> Lots of really fun accessories in here. Like I said, you could just make for a really festive uh, overall painting experience i feel like so anyway we're down to our last door here door number 12 where's the little there it is and this one like i said i actually i have no idea what this particular painting is it's not been spoiled for me it's an actual true surprise so get to end it with a fun surprise and let's take a look oh cute did we know that diamond art club had peanuts is this new? This is a fun way to announce that. If so, I don't remember if we knew the Diamond Art Club had peanuts. So we have a little classic Snoopy house. Okay, for a lot of people, I feel like that Charlie Brown Christmas movie is classic required viewing during the holidays. Kind of my family included. We should really uh, get our kids into that this year because, um, I, I mean, I, my husband and I did growing up, but we haven't really introduced our kids to Charlie Brown Christmas, so we should really do that this year. This is adorable. And yeah, if we didn't know that Diamond Art Club had peanuts, well, now you know. So this one's gonna be nine by 11 and a half inches or 23 by 29 uh, centimeters. And uh, like they do with a lot of their um, like special uh, IP agreements with other brands, this has some really fun branding on the box, like very Charlie Brown with the yellow and the black uh, slashes here. And uh, and that like, oh, the fun like comic book print on the back, that's so cute. And then there's the usual info here on the side. I'm gonna look at this canvas really quick with you guys. While my kiddos are still being <laughs> chill. <laughs> so, uh, uh, yeah, speaking of, Micah's like, uh, you were saying? <laughs> So, and yeah, yes, Connor. <laughs> so, oh my gosh, it's so little and so cute. Okay, so like the other one, this one comes with kind of the, the smaller toolkit and like the smaller instruction book here. But look at how little and cute this is. Only nine colors. Oh my gosh, but look, one, two, three, four, five crystals or iridescent colors. That's what this L means. I bet it's all the Christmas lights. Yeah. So all the Christmas lights on here are going to be iridescent or crystal diamonds. That is so perfect. Oh my gosh. I love that so much. That is adorable. There's that original artwork and the sticker sheet. And let's see, can you see them? No, they're buried in here. Okay. I know I didn't open up the diamonds on the other one. I'm going to open it up in this one. Okay, there we go. <laughs> so we've kind of like a tangerine orange, a yellow, a green, oops, a blue, and a pink. So those are gonna be all of our all of our Christmas lights. So, oh, that's so cute. So that is day number 12, and what a cute and fun way to end the advent calendar. So you guys, this is uh, Diamond Art Club's 2023 advent calendar. Like I said, unfortunately it has sold out, but um, what happened last year, and I'm guessing is gonna happen this year, is that people are gonna get theirs in and decide that there are various things that they don't necessarily want to keep for themselves, and they're gonna list them for sale in D-stash groups or similar. So I'll try to um, find a few to link you to below that you can keep an eye out if there's anything in here that you're like, ooh, I really wanna try to get that, and I missed out on the whole advent calendar. or if you got the advent calendar and know there are things that you don't want to keep you can totally go that route but this was really fun um the price point was i think it was 125 125 us dollars and you did get a lot for that you know you did get lots of accessories and fun holiday themed things, including, you know, two kits and lots of special drill things. So I'll leave it up to you if you feel like that like price point, if the value matches it. But um, certainly the experience of getting to unbox a bunch of like Diamond Art Club things, like over the course of 12 days, especially if you spread it out. Some people would say like, oh, the value is there for me. Uh, totally up to you. I'm hoping that in future years, Diamond Art Club is going to continue to do these advent calendars because I do think that they are really popular. And um, so you'll just you have to keep an eye out they'll announce it on their social media and when they release i just say you know you gotta set your alarms and you know save your money up and whatnot ahead of time because 
if last year their first year of doing it was any indication and this year as well, they're just, they're going to sell out really quickly. So anyway, you guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope this was fun. I know I loved getting into it with all of you. Thanks for uh, being totally fine with my kiddos hanging out in the background a little bit. And, um, I, <laughs> and uh, feel free to subscribe if you want to stay up to date with lots more diamond painting content for me. I have some more advent calendars on the way that I'm excited to share with you guys when they come in. Uh, and I hope that you have a fantastic holiday season and a day that is as amazing as you are. And I'll chat with you in the next one. Bye.